Hey, Vermilion Parish homeowners, it's Jim Cady, your Vermilion Parish real estate expert, and this is your quick real estate market update. So over the past month, we've had lots of conversations with a number of my clients, friends, and family, and they're all asking me the same thing. What is going on with the market? With these interest rates and everything else that's going on in the economy, is the value of my house going up or is it going down? Am I safe? Am I okay? Well, while it's hard to determine the month over month of how the value of your house is actually holding up, what we can do is compare the same time period last year versus this year to see how home values have actually been affected. But unfortunately, the year-to-date average of home values have actually gone down 3%, which is about $6,900 less than last year. This is a slight decrease, but it's a decrease, and it's reflecting the broader economic trends that we're all experiencing. Now, here's where it gets a little interesting. Did you know that at any given time or particular time, pre-COVID or leading up to 2020, on average, there was about 162 homes for sale. As of today, there are about 219 homes for sale, which means there's an increase in supply. So if you own a home and you're thinking now might be the right time to move, you still do have a valuable asset, but there is more competition in the market. So what does this mean if you're thinking about buying a home? Well, if you if you it, it means that you still have to have a great strategy to navigate the market with uh, increased listing, increased supply, and understand the ins of out ins and outs of a competitive uh, making competitive offers to get the most amount of money that you can in equity on your property at the purchase. If either of these situations resonate with you, stay tuned for more home buyer and seller tips. And until next month, I'm Jim Cady, your Vermilion Parish real estate expert, and thank you so much for tuning in.